Hey everybody, Coke Man 250 here. Well, today I'm gonna be painting the barn. Got this old gray color. Yesterday I pressure washed it. Got a lot of the old paint chips off and we're going back barn red. So, we're fixing to get to work. See how it changes the appearance. All right, so I got all the red pretty much painted. I got another gallon on its way, but I'm just starting the white. Hey everybody, well, I've been painting. And let me tell you the reason why I've been painting the old barn. That barn probably ain't been painted in who knows how long. But uh, refinancing my house, uh, going from a 4.5% interest rate down to 2.9%. Uh, rolling a few things into it and going from a I was on a 30-year mortgage now I'm going to a 15-year mortgage um, I still owed about 20 years on my 30-year mortgage so I'm actually dropping five years off of it and uh, in 15 years that'll be let's see here in about two weeks it'll be 16 years for me where I work so in another 14 years that's 30 years at the company and uh, you know retirement may be in my future I'll only be 48 years old but uh, that's the goal I'm working toward uh, all my prepping all my homesteading stuff is really setting me up for my retirement and when I say retirement I mean not retirement from serving the Lord not retirement from uh, working but uh, retirement from working for the man <laughs> So anyway, one of the one of the things to my appraisal, since my house was built before 1978, they wanted the old barn painted uh, in case there was lead-based paint on it. You know, it was chipping and flaking off, and the old barn needed to be painted. Hey, it really freshens it up, makes it look pretty pretty awesome. I know I haven't been making a lot of videos. Uh, it's been about a month and a half probably, and that's that's not like me I try to put one out every couple weeks at least and I got on a roll there where I was putting out two or three a week and uh, I was having fun with it and then we started this refinance process uh, in a way there was some other stuff busy at work and stuff but once I started this refinance um, you know we wanted to clean a lot of stuff up and we went through a lot of stuff in the house and and organized and cleaned up before the appraiser came uh, so that's what I've been doing, and uh, appreciate you guys sticking with me. I've had a few PMs, uh, a few Facebook messages asking me where I've been, and uh, seeing if I was okay. Everybody's okay, and uh, you know we're just busy, busy, busy on the homestead, getting ready for, uh, you know, getting through this free finance and getting ready for winter. You know, I've been getting a lot of firewood lately. Uh, my chainsaw's in the shop right now, but. Uh, Anyway, as soon as I get that thing back, it'll be back to cutting some firewood. But just wanted to throw up a little quick video for you guys, kind of check in, show you what I was doing today. And uh, it's dark now. I just finished up painting. So tomorrow I'll get, I'll get a shot to tack on to the end of this of the finished barn. And I went ahead and painted the chicken coop while I was at it. So this is Coke Man 250 from the land of the free and the home of the brave. God bless everybody. And remember... Prep smarter and pray harder. All right. So there's the finished product. Got her all painted and freshened up. Even did the chicken coop. 